What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, Leo, and you enjoy my content, you can smash the subscribe button to be notified for future readings. This is your channel for reading for a sign of Leo. This resonates with Leo in any aspects of your chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Sun, Moon, which is your chart. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. Fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys so much. If you'd like to um, donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. Thanks for all the new subscribers. Thanks for all the love and support to the channel. All the shares of my content is really, really helping my um, channel get around to people that do not know about it. Um, I really appreciate that very much from the bottom of my heart chakra. Love you guys so much. This is uh, for any aspects of Leo in your chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Sun, Moon, Hey, Richard, your chart. And always, only take the messages that resonate and lead the rest. This is free general collective reading. All right, so I received one channel message as I was meditating on your energy. Uh, this is for 11-7 of 2022 to 11-14 of 2022. Uh, the channel message I received, Leo, was um, a Pisces and a Virgo's affair um, going very public is about to benefit you in a huge way. That's what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. A Pisces and a Virgo's affair going very public. <clears throat> so there's some, it could be a masculine or feminine Pisces, masculine or feminine Virgo. Masculine Virgo, feminine Pisces. Okay, it's a masculine Virgo and a fem Pisces. So it's a masculine Virgo and a fem Pisces. Their affair about to go very, very, very public is about to benefit you in a huge way, Leo. I feel you can be masculine or fem Leo. You can have Leo in any aspects of your charts, but it's a masculine Virgo and a feminine Pisces affair about to go very, very, very public. It's about to benefit you in a huge way. So you plug it in, how it resonates, Leo. However, that resonates and applies, okay? Spirit messages you have for sign of Leo. We have hummingbird and whale. For some, you could do them with an air sign or water sign. If you are, they could, could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. And their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or them in here, Jupiter charts, if you are Leo. Bo, you are highly thought of. Fair woman, dealings or relationship with a woman with blonde, gray, or white hair. Spirit messages you have collected. Well, family wish wishes come true. Excuse me. Spirit message you have collected. Wake up call. Hummingbird, whale. Hummingbird. Someone is trying very, very, very hard. You're a Fem Leo business owner. Another Fem Energy karmic to you is trying very hard to copy your work, your content. But it but it's already backfired on her. It's going to, going to continue backfire on her. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates Leo. You're a Fem Leo business owner, and it's a karmic to you. So she doesn't have good intentions for you or the situation. She's trying to uh, copy your content and your work. Whatever you do um, as far as content and work. But she is a karmic to you. So she does not have good intentions for you or the situation. It sounds like she's just trying to copy your content and work because 
she knows it makes you money or she thinks it makes you money. Probably that resonates because I heard your business over. But I heard it's already backfired on her and it's going to continue to backfire on her. So I think you are the hummingbird spirit here, um, uh, Fem Leo, business owner. Uh, I feel your light side and I feel you can do anything. Um, I feel you're very creative. If this resonates for you, I didn't hear you were, but I feel you are. And um, you are loud and I feel you are, very, hummingbirds are very loud and proud. They're very loud and proud. And to me, this signifies public eye energy too. Um, I feel you're very heavily in the public eye with whatever you do. I feel it's creative. I didn't hear it was, but I feel it is. I feel you're very heavily in the public eye with whatever business endeavor or endeavors you're pursuing here, but you are the original here and you've got a karmic femme energy basically trying to copy the hell out of you um, because she thinks it makes you money or she knows it makes you money, but it's already backfired on her and it's going to continue backfire. For one, it's your sister. For one, it's an ex coworker. It's about to backfire in a huge ass way. Okay, I heard for one, it's your sister, and for one, it's an ex-coworker, and it's about to backfire in a huge-ass way. So, for one, it's your sister doing this. Um, a strange sister. A strange sister. For one, it's your strange sister doing this to you, and for one, it is a ex fem coworker. But how that resonates, I heard it's already backfired, and soon it's about to backfire in a huge-ass way. So, I feel you're... Very heavily in the public eye, or they are, or you both are, but it's but it's already backfired on them, and it's going to continue to backfire. But the thing is, is you're the original here. You're the original um, person here, Leo Femme, so it should backfire on them. Um, if it's copyrighted material, I hope you find out about it, and then you slap their ass with a copyright claim. Copyright inf infringement lawsuit, and I'm just being for real, for real. I'm serious. Several shocking series of chain of events are about to occur with this situation soon. There's about to be huge exposure here. Huge. Several shocking series of chain of events are about to occur with this situation soon. There's about to be huge exposure here soon. Huge. So, I feel for one of you Leo Finn business owners that somebody, either your estranged sister or an ex-coworker, is strategically either copying your content or trying to copy your content or plagiarizing you or what have you, what have you. Um something to do with some kind of um, copying you in your work, your business. Um, several shocking series of chain of events are about to occur and um, huge exposure. So hopefully the huge exposure is somebody about to tell you that your estranged sister or your ex femme co-worker is copying your shit or trying to copy your shit. That's what I hope. And I hope they're going to be loud and proud with the hummingbird energy and tell you. Well, nature is about to become very significant in a Leo's life. Getting out nature positive. Nature, getting out nature um, in a positive way is about to become very significant in Leo's life. I feel you can be master in Leo. It sounds like you're about to get out nature in a very positive way. Either you're not used to getting out nature or you're about to get out nature more. For some, I feel you're nature lovers. Um, and you're about to incorporate physically like outdoor physical activities into your life or incorporate them more into your life. Um, I feel this could be hiking, biking, cycling. Walking, jogging, anything outdoors, um, sightseeing, what have you, what have you, but some kind of outdoor, excuse me, outdoor um, incorporation into your life more, more nature. Um, I feel you might like animals, you might like nature, you might like wildlife, you might like, uh, I think you like those things and you're about to incorporate into your life more. And for some, I feel this could include increased physical activity. I didn't hear that, but intuitively, I feel it. And we all need more of that. Um, and that's just the truth because it helps our bodies. It helps us um, more in a healthy standpoint. Um, congratulations to whoever that's for. Um, just saying, just saying. Well.
A light side position of authority masculine is about to become very significant in Leo's life soon in a positive way. For one, it's a federal agent. For one, it's an investigator. For one, it is a doctor. For one, it's a businessman. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. So, uh, light side, position of authority, masculine energy here, strong. Um, for some, it could be a water sign, or they could have water in their chart, or not. Um, they, For some, I feel they might have water in their chart or be a water sign, but they don't have to be. Um, the whales um, in the animal spirit are indicative of leaders. Whales are leaders and um, leaders of the ocean. People look up to the whales. Um, I'm, I'm sorry, not people. The while um, the sea life look up to the whales in the ocean. They are strong arms and not strong arms, but respected leaders in the ocean, basically. So I'm just being for real. So for some, it could be a they could have water, water in their chart or be a water sign, but they don't have to be. Uh, but I do think they're respected by their peers. Uh, I think they are seen in a positive light in their society and community like the whale is in the ocean. Um, and it is a masculine energy, whether it's a federal agent, an investigator, a doctor, or a, um, who was the other one? Federal agent, doctor, um, investigator, federal agent, investigator, doctor, or um, Business person and a lawyer and a lawyer and a lawyer and a lawyer. Um, so you, these are all light side. So they treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values, how that resonates and applies. But I think they're leaders in their field, like the whale is the leader in the ocean, and they could have water in their chart or not. I didn't I didn't hear they did, but they're all masculine energies. For some, you could interact with one of these people for one, two, or two plus. Federal agent, investigator, lawyer, doctor, and um, who was the other one? Business man, businessman, businessman. So you plug it in how it resonates, Leo. All right. <clears throat> Bo, you were highly thought of. One Leo that was not respected in their community in the past because of serious setup energy. Now they're very highly respected and they're going to gain more, more respect. Okay, so for one of you guys, you were not highly respected in your community, community in the past because of some kind of intentional setup energy. But I heard now you are respected. Now you are respected in your, your community. So you're highly thought of in your community now. In the past, you wasn't because there was some kind of intentional setup energy, but energy shifted and things have changed. So 555 five, five energy, now you are respected. Now you are thought of, highly thought of, and um, I heard you're going to continue to be well respected in your community. But it sounds like whoever this is for, you were the only reason you were not well respected in your community in the past is because of some kind of intentional setup energy. So you plug it in how it resonates. So it sounds like the energy's already shifted and it's going to continue to shift in a positive way for you if this resonates and applies for you. Business is about to go up. Positive contacts are about to go up. Money is about to go up. Business is about to go up, money's about to go up, and positive contacts are about to go up. So if this re resonates and applies for you, Leo, you were once intentionally set up in your community, but energy shifted and now you're not. Um, business is about to go up, uh, contacts are about to go up, and um, money's about to go up. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Uh, I feel for one, you could be a business owner, possibly. Um, for one, maybe not. Uh, maybe you work out in the 3D workspace, but you plug it in how it resonates, but how that resonates, you were intentionally set up in your community in the past, but you're not anymore.
Through many series of chain of events, a water sign is about to be sentenced to prison soon. It's a water sign masculine. He thought, he, he thinks he's going to not, but he will be. It's going to shock him and his family, but it's about to benefit you in a situation in a huge way. Oh my God, whoa. Some kind of water sign masculine energy. It sounds like he's away, um, sounds like he's already been, he's either in trial right now, like a jury trial, or he's about to have a jury trial. How that resonates and applies. It's Cancer Pisces Scorpio masculine energy. Um, but however that resonates to you, Leo, um, he's already, he's either already finished his jury trial or he's in it right now, how that resonates and applies. But I heard soon through many series of chain of events, he's about to be sentenced to prison. Um, I heard it's, um, he doesn't think he's going to be, he doesn't think he's going to be sentenced. His family doesn't think he's going to be sentenced, but I heard he is going to be, he's going to be, and I heard it's going to shock the hell out of him and his family, but I heard it's going to end up benefiting you and the community, community in a huge way him being sentenced to prison he needs he needs to learn a good ass lesson and he needs to do it in prison he needs to learn a good ass lesson and he needs to do it in prison is what i heard uh so whoever this water sign masculine is to you leo i think for some he might have harmed you in some shape form or fashion in the past for some he might have said uh intentionally set you up in the past possibly um but only you know your situation story, not anybody else. But I, I did hear from Spiritual Realm that he needs to learn a good-ass lesson in prison. But he doesn't think he's going to be sentenced to prison, and his family doesn't think he's going to be sentenced to prison. So I intuitively think they probably have money uh, and good lawyers is what I think. But um, but I heard he's going to be. I heard he's going to be. So um, way too much evidence. Way too much. Way too much evidence, way too much is what I heard. There's way too much evidence. So there's some kind of way too much evidence that it sounds like it's going to nail, put the nail in the coffin and seal the deal for the uh, prison conviction is what it sounds like here. Um, wake up call. It's a Cancer Pisces Scorpio masculine, but I, I heard from the spiritual realm that he needs to learn a good ass lesson and he needs to do it in prison. Once this conviction is finalized, it's about to go all over a city and spread like wildfire. Once this conviction is finalized, it's going to go all over a city and it's going to spread like wildfire. So he hasn't been convicted to prison yet. He hasn't been convicted and um, sentenced to prison and all that yet, but it sounds like it's upcoming in the universe, and I heard once it happens, Leo, whoever you are and however you apply to this Scorpio masculine, um, I heard uh, it's going to go all over the city and spread like wildfire, but I heard it's going to benefit you and your community in a huge way that he basically gets sentenced to prison um, because he needs to learn a good lesson, and it needs to be in prison, and apparently it, there was a lot of evidence um, for whatever the hell he did. I didn't hear what he did. Um but for some, I feel it could have been intentionally setting you up in the past, possibly. Um, but you plug in how it resonates. But he doesn't seem he's going to be, he doesn't seem to think he's going to be convicted. Um, and neither does his family. But it's him and his family is about to get a huge ass wake up call, uh, Leo. Fair woman dealing with a relationship with a woman with blonde, gray, or white hair. A very ill Capricorn, older Capricorn feminine is about to pass away soon. It's about to become very significant in a Leo, Leo's life soon. A very ill, older Capricorn feminine is about to pass away soon. I heard it's about to become very significant in a, a Leo's life soon. So whoever this very ill, older Capricorn femme is to you, Leo. Um, I feel she could have blonde, gray, or white hair. Um, and 
I heard she's older, so I think she's 35, 36 or above, and she could have Capricorn in any aspects of her chart. She, um, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Moon, 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 Jupiter charts. Um, she's very ill. I didn't hear what kind of illness she has, whether it's medical, mental health, or both, but um, I heard she's about to pass away soon. Um, it's going to shock a lot of people, but she's a lot iller than she leads on. Okay, okay, so the death is about to cause a wake-up call in people. I heard she's, um, okay, so she's more ill than she leads on to people. Um, and I heard the death is about to, um, shock a lot of people, but she's more ill than she leads on to people. So she doesn't come off to the public or to society like she's as ill as she is, but in reality she is. Now, I didn't hear what she has, but... It, whatever it is, it's about, I mean, she's about to pass away soon, and it's going to give her community and society a wake-up call. It's not a death that people are expecting. I don't feel she's on hospice, is what I'm trying to say. It's an older Capricorn feminine. She could be 35, 36 or above, have caps at any aspects of her charts. Seven moon rising, Venus, or moon, and hammer Jupiter charts. 50s and 60s. 50s and 60s is what I just heard. So there's at least two of them. There's at least two. I heard 50s and 60s. So I think this Capricorn femme is in her 50s or 60s. Because um, uh, I heard 50s and 60s. So I feel she could be born in the 50s, 50s or the 60s. Or she could be in her 50s or 60s. I heard 50s and 60s. So she's either was born in the 1950s or the 1960s. I can't speak. Ah. She was either born in the 1950s or the 1960s, or I feel she's either in her 50s, so 50 to 59, or 60, 60 to 69. But she's about to pass away soon. She's a lot iller than she leads on to the society and public and what have you, what have you. Whoever she is to you, Leo. But the death is about to come very significant in your life, either in a positive or negative way. For one, she's your current boss. For one, she's your former boss. For one, she's a family member. Okay, so for one of you, Leo, she is a family member. One, she's your current boss. One, she's your former boss. So you plug it in how it resonates, whoever this older Caps fam is. For one of you, Leo, she's your current boss. So manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO, I'm feeling. For one, she's your former boss. So man manager, boss, supervisor, or CEO, I'm feeling. And for one, she is a family member. So you plug it in how it resonates. I feel she's either 50 to 59 or 60 to 69 or born in 1950s or 1960s. How that resonates and applies. Oh my goodness. But it's about to give society and her community a wake up call. For one, after she passes away, a lot of information about her sabotaging you in the past is about to come to light. Sabotaging you in a workplace situation. It's going to create seri positive series of chain of events for you in a particular company. Former company you are employed in. Probable reinstatement. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates. Wow. So for one of you guys, um, your former boss, because I heard there's three situations here, whether it's your family member, your current boss, or your former boss. For, for, for one, your former boss, if this resonates for you and she ends up passing away, um, I heard once she passes away, your former boss situation here, I heard a lot of information about her sabotaging you in the past is going to come to the light and um, after she passes. And um, she works in a, it sounds like a um, corporate conglomerate here. Definite corporate conglomerate. Definite corporate conglomerate. That's confirmation. So she works in a definite corporate conglomerate. But once she passes away, information of her sabotaging you in the past is going to come to the light. And I heard it's going to come to the light and come to light quickly. And when it does, you will probably, uh, I heard probable reinstatement. So you probably will be reinstated back into the company. It sounds like she sabotaged you in a wrongful termination. I didn't hear a wrongful termination, but she definitely sabotaged you. So I think you're out of the company of the hands of her or the hands of her and other people. 
how that resonates and applies. But once she passes away, if you resonate in the former boss category, news of her sabotaging your ass is going to come to the light. And I heard it's going to go positive for you. You will probably get reinstated. So I think she wrongfully terminated. She either wrongfully terminated you or had a big hand in the honeypot and wrongfully terminated you. I heard probable, probable reinstatement. So I didn't hear you were going to be reinstated, Leo, Mask on a Femme, if that resonates for you. But you probably will. And probable reinstatement, meaning you're not in the company anymore. And I don't think you did. I don't think you just put your two week in and just left. I, I heard she sabotaged you. So she had a hand in getting you out of the company, basically. And that could be the, um, you, you were highly thought of too. Pro with the probable reinstatement. I heard it's going to happen quickly after she passes. It's a Capricorn fam. She, I feel she's either 50 to 59 or 60 to 69 or born in 1950s or 1960s. How that resonates and applies, okay? A bond between a Leo and a feminine energy is going to continue to continue both them energies. She has blonde hair. Okay, so if that resonates with you, there's two fem energies here. For one, you are the fem energy, Leo. For one, it's a another fem energy and she has blonde hair. There's some kind of bond you've already formed with this person, and it sounds like a positive, copacetic manner in some shape, form, or fashion. But however that resonates, the bond's already there, and it's a positive, copacetic bond, um, positive connection, if that resonates. But I've heard um, the bond's going to continue, so it's going to strengthen, and it's going to be positive in a positive, healthy way. Um, and I heard sh um, she has blonde hair. So she has blonde hair, whoever this other femme energy is, and you are femme, femme energy. I feel you could have any color hair, but she definitely has blonde hair. And you are femme energy, and she is a femme energy, if that resonates and applies. And for some of you guys, it, this could be this person in that situation, okay? So you plug in how it resonates, so positive feminine bonding in a positive friendship kind of way. Healthy way, not like a backstabbing, um, sleeping with your man, um, Stealing 500 bucks from you, what have you, what have you. I think she might think highly of you, possibly, or and you think highly of her, is what I think, possibly. Well, family wishes come true. For one, Leo, they're about they're about to get engaged. For one, they're about to get married. Oh, congratulations, Leo. Whoever that's for. For one, you're about to get engaged, and for one, you're about to get married. So it's gonna make your family wishes come true. For some, I feel you could have kids because we have the family card. For some, it it just may not be. It may just be you and um you and your partner. Um, but for some, I feel you might be a single parent. Uh, possibly. I didn't hear you were, but intuitively, I feel for some, you were single parents. Um, possibly. For some, you may not be. It um, may, Maybe you're not. But um, intuitively, I feel for some, you might be. But how that resonates, for some, you are uh, about to get engaged, um, whether you are proposing or you're about to pr propose to. And for some, you're about to get married, so I feel you're already, uh, you're already engaged. Um, but it's going to make your family wishes come true. The uh, proposal, or you proposing, or getting married. Congratulations to whoever that's for, if you want to be married or proposed to. Congratulations. And it sounds like in this case, you, you do. So, just saying. <clears throat> there are many series of shame events. A very light side single mother is about to get her kids back soon. It's about to make her very happy. Leo Femme, single mother. 
Her mini series of chain of events, uh, Light Side, Leo, Single Mother, is about to get her kids back. I heard it's going to make her very happy. Um, whoever this Leo Finn single mother is, family wishes coming true in this aspect is a single mother, light side, uh, light side, Leo Finn single mother, about to get her kids back. So it's going to make her, if this resonates for you, ma'am, you are a single mother and her kids. So you have two or two plus kids. It doesn't sound, um, you could have no rights, um, visitation rights, uh, half and half rights, or whatever whatever rights um i'm not you know everybody's court paperwork's different but um but you definitely don't have full custody right now i'll tell you that whoever you are um leo femme single mother of two or two plus kids but how that resonates i heard through many series chain events you're, it sounds like you're about to have full custody um whether you've already had full custody of them at previous or you haven't it sounds like you're about to it's going to make your family wishes come true Congratulations to whoever that's for. I think you're highly thought of. You're very highly thought of. You're very highly thought of is what I heard. This confirmation. So you're very highly thought of. So uh, whoever you are, I think you really deserve it. I think you truly deserve it. And uh, whoever this is for, um, if you had your kids taken away and you shouldn't have, I think it's about to be balanced out in the universe and you're about to get them back. And it's about to make your family wishes come true. That's what I feel. But you plug in how it resonates. Congratulations to whoever that's for. You're a Leo fan, single mother, if that resonates for you. And you're very light side. So you treat people honestly, trust, respect, morals, ethics, integrity, and values. And I think you truly, I heard you, well, I heard in here, you truly deserve it. You deserve it. And you're very highly thought of. And you basically deserve to have your kids back. So you plug in how it resonates. Wake up call. A particular Leo psychic has been helping solve crimes left and right, left and right, left and right, left and right. Through many series of chain of events, they're about to be rewarded in the universe in a huge way. They were not properly rewarded in the past. Okay, Leo, whoever you are, um, you're a psychic. Uh, so I heard you've been helping solve crimes left and right, left and right, left and right, left and right. So. I feel psychic investigator energy here. I didn't hear you were, but, you know, we all label ourselves different titles. So, um, you could call yourself a psychic investigator or not. I'm not sure. But I heard you basically, I think you've been giving other people wake-up calls in this aspect. I think you've been giving other people wake-up calls because I heard you've been helping solve crimes left and right, left and right, left and right. So, you do some kind of work in some shape, form, or fashion that's been helping people, I think, police. Private investigators, public investigators, feds, whoever, whoever, whoever is able to help solve the crimes. Um, you're a psychic, so obviously you're not out there um, collecting the evidence or processing it in or pulling the DNA evidence or doing the CSI shit, just saying, just saying. But you're pulling the energy through the universe, and I feel you have a public platform. I didn't hear you did, but I feel you do. To be able to deliver the messages out to people that are interested in hearing the messages so they can help solve the crimes. Like a psychic investigator energy. I heard you're a psychic, so you're pulling the energy and you're delivering what you are channeling through. Um, and whoever you are, you've been helping people left and right, left and right, left and right, past energy, solve these crimes. And I feel it's police. Uh, investigator, public or private, or feds, or what have you, what have you. I heard you were not properly compensated for it in the past, but there are many series of chain events you're about to be. So, some kind of reward energy. So, it sounds like somebody is really appreciate appreciates your work, and they have gotten a wake-up call in the past. Um, maybe they thought your work was not correct, or, or they thought you were a fraud, or a fake, or a phony, or a 
um, whatever, whatever, and they actually started taking you serious and you actually started helping them solve some shit is what I'm feeling. Um, congratulations, sir, ma'am, if that resonates for you. But wake up call here as far as you helping solve these crimes. Heard you've been solving them in the past, left and right, left and right, left and right, left and right, helping solve them. So whatever information you were, I feel you're putting it on a public platform with the hummingbird energy. And I feel you're a leader in your field. I feel you're a psychic investigator. I think you're the whale in this aspect, a leader in your field, because whatever information you're delivering is very important and useful and it's helping people out in the actual field solve these crimes with whatever information you're delivering. And, or you have delivered in the past. You have been very helpful. Very. And you're about to be rewarded for it in a huge way. Okay, I heard you've been very helpful, very, and you're about to be rewarded for it in a huge way. So, yeah, I think you're helping police, <clears throat> police and public and private investigators and feds and people all across, wherever, wherever, um, and I strongly feel whoever this is for, you have a public platform with the public energy, public eye energy with the hummingbird. Um, and I feel you're a leader in your field because whatever your information you're delivering, it's the damn truth. Um, and you're about to be rewarded for it in a huge way. I heard you were not um, rewarded for it in the past. Um, you were not basically paid, you know, um, paid properly for the work you were delivering. But um, through many series of chain events, it sounds like you're about to with some kind of reward energy. Um, so I think this is wake up call for the people that didn't take you seriously in the past, but I think people are about to, because for one, you're about to be rewarded, uh, like uh, an actual, I feel cash reward or monetary reward. Um, I feel you might, uh, you might get public recognition possibly. I didn't hear you were going to, but you might. And if you do, it's going to give all these people that have hee-hawed and laughed and gawked and hee-hawed and thought you were um, crazy and out of your mind a wake-up call because you really have been helping solve crimes left and right, left and right, left and right. But I feel people have been making fun of you is what I think. They have laughed at you and laughed at you and laughed at you, but soon they're about to get a wake-up call. Okay, I heard they have laughed at you and laughed at you and laughed at you and laughed at you. So, yeah, people have gawked and hee-hawed and just made fun of your ass, thought you were crazy. Whoever you are, Leo's a uh, psychic investigator here. But I heard soon they're about to get the wake-up call. So they're about to get the wake-up call because it sounds like you're about to get rewarded here. And for some, you might get publicly recognized, which will give these people that laughed and gawked and hee-hawed at you and thought, called you crazy and gossiped at you behind your back and all kinds of crazy shit a wake-up call because they're about to realize you really are the real deal. And I feel for some, they probably already know you are the real deal. They just don't want to admit it. And that's just the truth. And I, um, with this and this, I think you might, for one, I didn't hear you were going to, but I feel for one, you might actually get public recognition. Um, Texas and Alabama is very significant in this, and Tennessee. Texas, Alabama, and Tennessee is very significant in this. So Texas, Alabama, and Tennessee, and Florida, and Florida. Texas, Alabama, Tennessee, and Florida is very significant in this. And New Jersey, and New Jersey. Texas, Alabama, Tennessee, Florida, and New Jersey are very significant in this. So I feel you might have helped solve crimes. Um, in Texas, Alabama, Tennessee, Florida, or New Jersey, or you might live in Texas, Alabama, Florida, or New Jersey, or someone that's about to give you the reward lives in Texas, Alabama, uh, Texas, Alabama, Tennessee, Florida, or New Jersey. How that resonates or applies? Um, those are the states I heard. A Leo masculine in his 20s is about to be put on administrative leave soon. 
Jill Sapp. A Leo masculine in his 20s is about to be put on administrative leave soon. Jill Sapp. So if this resonates for you, you're a Leo masculine in your, in your 20s. Uh, I feel 20 to 29. I heard you're about to be put on administrative leave soon. You are jail staff. Um, now, whatever jail you work in, I'm not sure, sir, but you are a Leo masculine and you're in your 20s. I feel in 20 to 29 and you're about to be put on administrative leave. I think you're about to get a wake up call, sir, if that resonates for you. But there's a reason you're about to be put on administrative leave. Uh, so only you know why you're about to be put on administrative leave, not anybody else. You're a Leo masculine, 20 to 29, if that resonates for you. And a protection order in a Leo masculine, 40s life is about to become very significant. And a protection order in a Leo masculine in his 40s life is about to become very significant. So a Leo masculine in his 40s is about to get a protection order filed against him or attempted to be filed against him. However, that resonates and applies some kind of protection order, whether it goes through or it is attempted to go through. It's a Leo masculine and he's in his 40s. I think he's about to get a wake up call with this protection order. I didn't hear anything else. A Leo feminine in her 40s is about to pass away soon unexpectedly. It's about to give many people in a community a huge wake-up call. going to claim suicide but there will be much more to this somebody needs to hear this claim cause of death will be suicide but there will be much more to this oh my god whoa okay a leo femme in her 40s is about to pass away soon so a leo feminine in her 40s so i feel she'd be 40 to 49 she could have leo in any aspects of her charts um she's about to pass away soon i heard it's going to shock the hell out of her community and m many people so wake up call in her community and to whoever she's connected to she's in her 40s 40 49 i heard the cause of death is going to be claimed to be suicide but i heard there's going to be much more to it somebody needs to hear this so i think for one you're about to investigate this um claiming cause of death claim suicide here um much more to this somebody really needs to hear this trying to silence her oh my god whoa oh my god oh my god oh my god um i heard much more to this somebody's trying to silence her the death hasn't occurred yet but it sounds like it's upcoming it's a leo pendant in her 40s so it should be 40 to 49 oh my god that's scary oh Coming from a 39-year-old woman, I'm just saying that's scary. She's 40 to 49, and um, she's about to pass away soon, but it sounds like somebody's, the cause of death is going to be claimed to be suicide, but some, I heard one of you guys needs to hear that, that they're going to claim the cause of death is suicide, but there's much, much more to it. I heard they're trying to, um, she knows too much. They're, they're going to silence her and claim that it's suicide, basically. She hasn't passed away yet. She's a Leo feminine. She's in 4049. She's very overweight. She has very dark hair. She's very overweight and she has dark hair if anybody needs to hear that. Oh my God. Somebody's about to try to claim that the death, they're, they're going to try to cover up the death and say it's a suicide, but it, it's not going to be a suicide. Somebody in reality, she knows too much about something, some kind of criminal act or acts in the past, I'm presuming. 
they're going to claim her death is a suicide, but it's not going to be because she knows too much. So somebody's trying is going to silence her and claim her death is a suicide. She's an overweight female and she has very dark hair. If anybody needs to hear that, she hasn't passed away yet. She's 40 to 49. If you might need to hear that, one of you guys apparently does. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh. I heard there's much more to this. I heard much more to this. Much more to this. Her death is somebody's trying to cover up some shit, shitey shit in the past. But there's way much more to it. So one of you guys needs to hear that. Oh my Lord. A new pair of shoes is about to become very significant in Leo's life and highly creative energy. A new pair of shoes and highly creative energy is about to become very significant in Leo's life. So I feel you can be masculine or feminine if that message applies for you. Um, much better energy. This is scary. Um, but I hope somebody solves this shit. And I'm just being for real. She hasn't passed away yet, but it sounds like it's about to happen soon. Um, it is about to happen soon. Trying to cover up the past. Okay, it's confirmation. It's about to happen soon. Trying to cover up the past. Her death. That's scary as hell. Okay, so um, for better news, whoever this is for, some kind of highly creative energy is about, it sounds like creative juice energy is about to occur for at least one of you and a new pair of shoes. So, I don't know about you guys, but I love new pair of shoes. If they actually fit my they got speed right, just saying. So a new pair of shoes and some kind of highly creative energy um, for whoever that's for. You plug in how it resonates. Love you guys so much. Hope this helps. Namaste.